guys welcome back to my channel so if you're new here it's lovely to have you but if you're old hey boo it's nice to have you back long time no see but a girl is finally back and today i'm here to teach you how to make this easy simple yet delicious green chili sauce now this sauce goes with so many dishes so it's sort of a staple that you should have in your refrigerator all the time here are the ingredients we're going to use. Okay, we're going to use some scotch bonnet peppers. We're going to use some scallions or spring onions. We're going to use some green um, bell peppers, some onions. Any onions you want, I'm using red onions today. We're going to use some ginger and garlic as well. Now, there's a few other um, ingredients we'll be using later on that I'm going to show you. Yes, I'm going to list all the ingredients in the description box below. So please do check them out so you can easily remember and then get your ingredients, okay, or put them together. So I'm chopping up my scallions, no particular way, just in a way that will be easy for my blender to work with. So that's what I'm doing here. And then we're going to start blending our stuff. Now I'm going to start with the ginger, garlic, um, the onions, and then um, the scallions. Now all of the ingredients I'm using are, are not going to fit in the blender, so we're just going to blend part of it and then blend the rest late, um, right after this, okay? So there's no particular reason why I'm blending these ones first. It's just because all of them cannot fit in there. So as much as you can fit them in there, and then easily blend it if you push all of it in there you know you're going to overwork your blender okay so don't do that next up we're adding some oil we're not going to blend with any water at all we're going to blend with oil and the oil is what we're going to use to cook our sauce okay so let's cover it nicely and then get it to blend up beautifully now this particular batch you want to make sure it's blending really really well because you have your ginger and garlic in there so you want them all to be very smooth so that you can easily enjoy your sauce then you don't end up biting on ginger and garlic later on when you're eating your sauce okay now fun fact there's no particular peppers that we use for this green chili sauce, okay? So whatever peppers you have, whatever green um, peppers you have at home, just put them all together, like scotch bonnet, habanero peppers, if you have jalapeno, if you have um, banana peppers, if you have scallions, green, green onions, whatever you have that is green, girl, just put them together and mash them all up together and make it into a sauce is going to be equally delicious and yummy okay <laughs> so now we're going on with our second batch here i'm do i'm doing the peppers and the rest of my um green onions and to that i've added some dried rosemary i'm going to add some aniseeds as well and this is going to help boost the flavors of our sauce okay there's no sauce without spices uh, with our um, flavor boosters so we're going to do that and that's going to make the sauce amazing so again I did not blend this with any water at all I used a little bit of oil and that is what we're going to use to fry our um, our peppers now okay so I put both the first and then the second blender stuff together I'm going to get everything out of the blender in there I don't waste anything in my kitchen at all yes so we're going to give this a good stir you want to stir continuously as you cook this because the moment you leave it it's going to burn or it's going to be splashing all over and it's going to be all over or all up in your face and we don't want that remember the peppers are spicy so you want to be very cautious so you're going to cook this on medium low heat you're not going to go anywhere close to high heat because it is going to burn and it's also going to create a a good bad mess okay we don't want that at all so keep stirring until all the all the waters are out or evaporated from the sauce and then that's when it's going to start frying when that happens we're going to add a little bit of oil just to help it fry up nicely and come together really well in the meantime guys if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do so now click on the subscribe button down below and you might as well click on the bell right next to it so you're notified anytime i upload a new content because this channel is lit okay <laughs> now i'm adding some shrimp stuck cube to it and then i'm going to add a little bit of salt to taste 
now the sauce is not all splashy because we are where well, most of the waters are out of it um, so we can just give this a good stir and then leave it for a while to fry up and then come together really nicely also if you have any comments or questions you can leave them down below give this video a thumbs up and please do not forget to share our sauce is almost ready look it's almost ready and it's looking really nice and bright and delicious give it a taste to make sure the salt is enough make sure your shrimp stock cube is enough and then we're going to leave the sauce to cool and then pack them up in our bottles now what i do is i keep this in my refrigerator i don't want to risk it by leaving it on my kitchen counter or the cabinet or in the pantry at all i keep them in these nice bottle containers and then i leave them in my fridge anytime i need it i just reach for it and then warm it up a bit if i have to or let it sit for a while and then the eyes or it will just thaw it will just get to room temperature and you can use it and enjoy it with whatever you want to if you're in a hurry you can just give it a quick warm and then you're ready to go the choices of dishes you can have this with is endless okay but i usually end up having it with fried yam it's delicious mm, amazing i have um so many chicken recipes over here on my channel you can check them out as well um, so you can have it with some fried rice, some chilla fries, some plantains, some kinky, yes, some chaffee, something delicious, yummy. Mm. Just enjoy your chili sauce, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to subscribe and see you next time. Bye!